It's been a difficult winter for people hoping to go out on the snowmobile trails. Area snowmobilers say they need just more than snow to open up the local trails. NBC 26's Abigail Hankey shows us what's been holding them back. Waiting on Mother Nature right now, and you know, it's kind of teasing us right now with this snow right here. The only tracks you'll see on area snowmobile trails right now are footprints. Right now, everybody's got to head north to find snow for snowmobiling. Yeah. The Howard Swamico Snowbird Snowmobile Club says they'll need more than just snow to open up the trails. While they're waiting for a good 8 to 10 inches of wet, heavy snow, Snowbirds president Eric Witt says they need the colder temperatures. We're waiting for it to get cold is really what we're because we need the ground to freeze. The ground's got very little frost in it right now and so we can't get our equipment out into the fields to do anything. Equipment that Witt says is needed to make the necessary improvements to keep the trails well maintained. We were pretty far behind. We're catching up slowly, but you know, we're not our trails. Even if we would get a bunch of snow today, our trails would not be ready to open because of the wet winter. The club says that they've had to delay a lot of projects, including this one of rebuilding the bridge, which they just finished Saturday. And they say they typically have all these projects done around November or December. Gwit adds their trails have been closed all season. That's up to Mother Nature. Uh, we you know, we don't control any of that, but they have until April 1st to keep them open, giving them some hope for a snowy ride in Howard. Abigail Hinky, NBC 26.